Hi folks, welcome to another episode of NYC CNC. This is the Judd Treat Machine. Judd is my two year old Vishla. He is absolutely awesome and absolutely man's best friend. I love him to death. And this past fall when I was working on Raspberry Pi and getting so in involved and excited about its potential, I thought, what's a project I can do that combines Judd, Raspberry Pi, and machining? So I came up with this device. It's a Raspberry Pi driven machine and Judd now has an email address, juddwouldlikeatreat at gmail.com. The Raspberry Pi runs a Python script that listens to Judd's email address. And when somebody sends Judd an email, it then wiggles the hopper to show that it's excited. The LCD message changes to woof woof, I'm about to get a treat. The tube rotates, which dispenses treats that are held inside the machine into the hopper. And then the hopper rotates via a servo motor and dumps them on the ground for Judd. And then finally, the coolest part I think, is that there's a USB webcam up here. And once the uh, treats are dumped onto the floor, the webcam snaps a picture. And then in Python, sends an email back with the picture as an attachment to the person who sent Judd an email saying thanks for the treats. So let's go ahead and take a look. I'm gonna go ahead and send Judd an email. Treats are dispensed in. And you can actually see Judd has been enjoying this videotaping process eagerly uh, standing by for treats. Should have snapped a picture as well. Let's take a look. Okay, sure enough, here's the email. Here's the picture. So that's it, folks. I did this project as a fun project to combine some things I'm passionate about. I'm going to open source it on my webpage, nyccnc.com, with the hopes that if you have any interest in using any part of this project for your own either dog treat machine or anything else, um, there, the code will be up there, the design will be up there, and hopefully this project can help others get involved. I think the potential behind Raspberry Pi is really incredible. Uh, it's not difficult to do. I had never even written a program in Python before, and this took me a little bit of while, but the code is well commented, so hopefully, um, hopefully it'll be helpful to you. I plan to post a few more videos showing more detail, Judd. I plan to post a few more videos about the project going into more detail on the design and the fabrication and the code, uh, but let me know in the comments below what you're interested in seeing. And if you like this, please give it a thumbs up, send it to your friends. Otherwise, have a good one, folks. Thanks.